Hey everyone, Christopher Beast here, and in today's video I'll be talking about why I think Vigor should consider the implementation of quests. So really, with no more delay, let's just get right into this video. So before I continue, I should preface here with the reason why I'm even talking about quests in the first place. And that reason is that in 10.1, which comes out tomorrow, challenges will be getting an update with a brand new screen and a UI that will make challenges feel more baked into the game and polished. With this new screen and UI, it is only natural that we should consider more ways to make use of these changes. Thus, I'd like to propose quests. These would be multiple challenges packed together that have something that ties them together, as well as a single reward at the end. We all know what quests are, and I think we can all imagine what I'm saying when I say this. These quests could be narrative-based or simply just stringing together the existing challenges in groups to give a single reward based off those challenges, maybe a bunch of shotgun challenges to give a shotgun-based reward. Either way, these quests would be harder, take more time, and be more rewarding than the existing challenges. So why is this important? Why should the devs spend time and add this instead of something else? Well, first, it could stand as a massive step towards fighting some of the RNG problems that the crate system currently has. Sticking popular plans for guns and heals that are unavailable through the regular battle passes or legacy seasons could be a massive way to decrease public disdain towards the RNG system the game currently uses, as people would feel that their work mattered as if they could complete a certain number of tasks to get a reward, rather than dealing with the RNG of crates and possibly never getting that reward, seeing as some items are just stupidly rare. This would also help with the challenge system, which I haven't really been able to explore too much of 10.1's overhaul of challenges, but regardless what it is, I think I'm going to make an early call here to say that it won't be enough to make challenges relevant. Quests could possibly do this. Quests would also add the valuable, much-needed endgame content, not everything everyone's been asking for, but a little taste of it, giving players who completed basically everything Vigor has to offer even more to do, something that we are kind of in the need of. And no, this wouldn't be the solution for the lack of endgame, but it could be a step towards the solution, and definitely help with the current problems. Quest could also be used as a reason behind using lesser used items, so people give them a chance and maybe convince people to give these lesser used items more use. It could also draw attention towards certain areas of the maps that are barely visited, and are kind of abandoned, with putting loot, like lootables for a quest in there. As a nice little neat addition, these quests could tie back to the lore, perhaps telling little stories of their own or developing the entire lore of Vigor just that much further, or maybe even developing the stories of the Battle Pass quests that we get. Regardless what the benefit is, I really think there's a lot of them, and which one you decide to focus on doesn't really matter, because you should be able to see that this is generally something that would be for the positive. I think if the dev, dev team has the time to do it, then Quest should be something they look into. But that's just my thoughts, and this has been Crystal Beast, and I hope to see you all next time.